Hello and good evening. This is Krillenheimer. Um, tonight's video is a little different. We're going to be playing Donkey Kong. Now, this is a very old game. I was probably my son's exact age uh, when I first played this, and I just loved it. It was not everywhere. It was very popular. Uh, he had his own cereal, he, which was basically Captain Crunch. He had his own, oh, his own cereal. Donkey Kong had his own cereal. I mean, Donkey Kong Jr. had hit also, which was basically Crunch Berries. Um, uh, we had, you know, a few sequels, Donkey Kong Jr., Donkey Kong 3, um, it's just been, I just love, once we found, you know, thought we would get the Switch for the kids, I'm like, okay, I know RK Donkey Kong is on here, I've got to get this. Um, okay, how do I? There it goes, okay. Okay, what we're going to do is I'm going to try to give a few pointers a few tips i'm not the best player um when i'm at my at my best game i can go to about round three or so um i'm in uh my highest score right now online is like fifty six thousand something which is in the later 300s overall for the entire online switch community which isn't bad, um, but let's go over a few things. Now, let me just go ahead and turn it again, and just go ahead. No, I don't want two players. Dang it. Here we go. And the first thing you need to understand is climb and jump. And you need to jump over the first barrel I mean, before he comes on the screen, you need to have that thing moving right. Just you keep moving, you keep moving, come up, hit the button. You know, climb and jump, climb and jump, climb and jump. Uh, you always want to get the, this that, that hammer for the points. And, you know, hang here till it runs out and do the normal. But you saw what I did. I mean, you have to keep going, go up that first ladder, immediately jump, and you will clear that first barrel before it goes down. Okay, here you want to go left. If I remember, I have a book, ancient book somewhere that shows the actual... Uh, pattern to the original arcade Donkey Kong. Ah, I just broke it. I don't, I don't think I, and one of them is either you, where you go straight up and down and now I'm all over the place, but I'm still going to, I'm still going to be. Yeah. And yeah, point wise, you want to try to get all the four or three Pauline items, but you're not going for points. You're going for survival. Um, and then there's a trick here. If you if you kind of hesitate, you can get that one right there. You, again, you want to bypass this hammer. And when it gets the barrels get too much. You know, you just have to, ah, uh, boy, I didn't think I was going to make that. Um, okay, yeah, you just saw where I jumped two barrels. It only gave me only 100 points. I have noticed one thing over, over playing Arcade Donkey Kong over the years. 
and not just the switch, just arcade Donkey Kong whenever I happen to find the emulation, a machine, or whatever, is that if you take too long to get to Pauline on this board, on board number one, he will really start, the barrels start just getting chaotic. Uh, and sometimes they will just go straight for you. Um, it is just strange. Okay. Let me pause. The first thing you do is the first thing you just saw me do. You go up both ladders, go up, you get the item. I think it was the umbrella. And you come back down to this level here. You wait for the flame to come down and ride it back up. Now, the best thing to do this is our version so it's extremely hard or not as easy to be able to jump from the elevator to here most of the time you will fall and die so it's best to take it easy and go all the way uh, start down and work your way up right, just to the right of the yellow thing is where the height is you want to move right as it's going over you and you can just about get it every time now the harder that board gets it's going to get be harder to anticipate that um and in some of the the pattern that i saw for completing this board I'm, I'm, I think I've already broken the pattern. Uh, sometimes you do, you're not supposed to actually run over the uh, those things, the, the rivlets or whatever they're called. You're actually supposed to jump over some of them uh, and not just run over them. It's apparently part of the original pattern which I've completely broken. Now I'm just at the mercy of surviving now. Um, crap. No, you, you got that gummit. I was trying to get fancy. There's a way you can jump kind of backwards and face Donkey Kong. And you can, um, in mid-jump, and sort of actually jump the opposite direction and now it's what I was trying to do and I shouldn't have and I died um, otherwise I'm actually doing pretty good right now I played two games before I started recording um, and just I didn't do this well yeah 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 Okay, and that's good strategy right there, too. Just right when you think you're going to, you know, run out of the hammer. Oh, I thought it was going to come down and fall on me, but it didn't. We got this. Okay, end of level two. So, I we all grew up on this version for the most part if you're in the U.S., or outside Japan so when we finally got the NES version of the crap of the game we got the Japanese layout minus the fourth board that's why we were so mad we didn't realize it was their version of the game um, for their stages because they changed it for us I had no idea I really did not know that the NES version we were playing was actually the Japanese layout. You know, uh, I'm using just the Switch Joy Con. I really, oh crap, hat was not smart. Not smart at all. Eh, this is my last man. Let's we'll see how far I get. I've done better than this. Eh, I'll just go ahead and get it.
if anything, for the points. I'm not doing the high score thing, if in case you noticed or not. Uh, see how many barrels are ganging up on me because I took too long. Um, that's a good, good way to see it right there. And my kids really could care less about Donkey Kong. I'm just really surprised of all the games that they like. And as much nostalgia, well, they don't get the nostalgia from like Stranger Things and stuff that we do. But as much as they like some of the old stuff, the old styles, they could care less about the games. And it's just, it's just flabbergasting. Um, <sighs> hmm. Well... I, I guess I'll I'll call it. Did I start it again? I didn't mean to, but and of all things, I will ad oddly admit, let's hear it for the boy works really well for this game because it's like uh, from the old Footloose soundtrack because it's like it seems to be from like the girl's point of view or the, or Pauline's point of view as she was later named. Um, wow, that was actually not bad. 4100 for the first board. can't remember if you're supposed to do a figure eight like this or you go just go straight across or you just start climbing up the tower back and forth um, it's, it's different very on, on on which stage you're on and you can jump those guys just like that it's possible but you have to be careful because of how finicky they are Well, I'm doing great now. Maybe I ought to keep recording. I was about to stop. <clears throat> Sorry. How high can you get? And my cousin showed me one time where he was able to just... Ba Whoa. Barely able to just... See, climb and jump, climb and jump. That's the, ah, I thought I had it. Uh, that's the point to this first one, uh, stage one. Climb the ladder and, and jump, you know, hit that jump button. That's the trick he was showing me. I just pulled it off, where you get the points without even jumping over the, the barrel. That was it. I, I pulled it off. Wow, that was close. And that's what I was talking about a second ago. In the last in the last game. Where it's like the the barrels just just start coming out of the woodwork. And I've seen it do it on level one. If you take too much time in level one, I mean, you can be where's my finger? Like right over here, and I've seen the barrel go thud right right at you. And it's rare, but it can happen. So I'm going to go straight up as fast as I can. Get that. Come all the way back down. Uh, that's unusual for the... Well, that's right. This is level 2, not level 1. And this is a bit of a timing thing here, too. And you just have to keep moving. And I, you never bother to get the purse. Or phone or whatever that is. That's how you do it. That was actually a good run. A good run there, and I'm I'm on level two. Come on, go up. Now, 
Let's see if I can get that, jump back over, get the hammer. Get maybe these two over here, or that one of them at least. There we go. That's 500 points. Maybe this one will come down. Yay, no. Ah, crap. Whoa, 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 don't come down yet. Yay, got it. I have just always enjoyed this game. Uh, we used uh, to have, you know, a Transformer boats. We used to would take one of the boats, go to the closest, whoa, that's coming down uh, at a funny angle, um, and take the boat to a certain gas station on the water that well it was on the water and on the road at the same time it, it you know could serve gas for see look there um i mean it went right at me anyway we, we would go on a sunday to quote unquote get grandmother's paper um we would get to go get the sunday paper it was a whole 50 cents back then Jump, jump. Ah, oh, didn't do it quick enough. Um, and that was bad timing. In this certain gas station on the water for boats and cars. It wasn't on the water. They had a marina. Um, they had a Donkey Kong machine. Whew, that was too close. And if I couldn't play it, I would at least go watch the demo. And half the time they'd let me, oh, you can't even see my score, but it's like 28,100. But you can see, well, you can't see my high score is actually 55,400. Let's see if I can move it up just a bit. There it is. So, that's Donkey Kong. And that's about the only t tips I have for, for it at the moment um, such as they are but it is remnants of some of the original patterns uh, from the original arcade game that you might be able to, to add if you even play this at all if you're a better player than I am you know feel free and, and add some comments that would be great too uh, thanks for watching have a blessed night and check out some other videos have a great night